In 1905, Alonzo Herndon started an investment and insurance company to service black Atlantans. It became one of the most successful black-owned businesses in the country. Well, today, the Atlanta Life Insurance Company is still thriving on Auburn Avenue. And as Fox 5's Portia Bruner shows us, Atlanta high school students are now learning some valuable lessons from the legacy of a former slave turned millionaire. The Herndon home in Northwest Atlanta tells the remarkable story of Alonzo Herndon, a Walton County man who went from slave to sharecropper to barber to Atlanta's first black millionaire. Now the lessons he learned as an entrepreneur more than 100 years ago are being taught to high school students right here in Metro Atlanta who want to own their own businesses. Welcome to the Herndon Home Museum. When you step into the Herndon Home Museum in Vine City, you immediately step back in time. About 100 years to be exact, barber turned Atlanta business mogul Alonzo Herndon had the elegant mansion built for his wife, Adrian. Constructed almost entirely by black carpenters, the home and each room in it tells the story of Herndon's journey from a social circle boy born into slavery to the prominent entrepreneur who founded the Atlanta Life Insurance Company on Auburn Avenue. Can you imagine this room full of people? Jaleesa Smith takes a lot of pride in sharing the Herndon family story, especially with young people who she says can learn a lot from Herndon's will and sense of self-determination. He sold molasses and he sold honey on the side of the road until he had that money, and that is the foundation that the entire Herndon legacy is built on. Smith wants to ensure every student involved in the Herndon Home Foundation's Game Changers program understands his principles of social entrepreneurship. How can I also, you know, help my peers? And I think that we try and instill that as we give them that very structured instruction. I feel like this made a real impact on like, how I see things now. Booker T. Washington High School senior Damian Watkins is dually enrolled at Clark Atlanta University, and Anasia Harris is a senior at Kip Collegiate. Both are active in the Game Changers program, which trains about 25 teenagers every year. And both plan to major in business when they go to college this fall. They're already learning some invaluable lessons from business leaders who meet with the students each month. I'm getting messages from people who have figured it out and I'm getting it now early so I think that that would help me for the long run. And that's exactly the point. The way they deal with each other, the way that they answer questions, you can see the metamorphosis over the course of months. At first like I used to think like you can just do something like start it and it just started but it's like a business it's steps and like Alonzo Herndon who left social circle on foot with only a few dollars in his pocket at the age of 20 these future entrepreneurs are among several game changers with big dreams and even bigger plans to make their businesses make a difference basically him with only $11 and walking to Jonesboro and really just like making something out of nothing and I think that's really important to me because really I don't really have much but I can make whatever I want with whatever I have. From Vine City in Northwest Atlanta, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News.